Hello my soccer universe for an international unpacking video. Yes, it has been loads of club shirts as of late, but you know with the World Cup coming there always need to be some national teams added. And I know that the part of my collection that is definitely the most in need of improving to is of course the Asian part. I got this here a Japan shirt, uh, got a Korea shirt, an Iran shirt already, so it's getting better, however it's not perfect. Now, so you know my uh, four Asian teams that I have. Now of those, Australia has always been my favorite, uh, with slight sympathies for um, Japan with the other teams, kind of so and so. However, uh, recently I saw for just 10 euros a uh, shirt of one of these teams popping up where I really thought, I would like, that's actually really, really nice and actually it might actually serve, although it's doubling up, it might actually serve me quite well uh, during the World Cup as well. So, you know, why not? It's 10 bucks um, at shipping to it 15. Uh, I think it is worth uh, buying that one. But the question is, which team will it be? It's not a new one. So it's either Australia, Japan, South Korea or Iran. Well, let me show you. I've already unpacked it. It has been hanging here. Um, it is Ta-ta! South Korea, the 2010 home. And I gotta say, the moment I saw it, uh, what I always liked this shirt, even back then. And, uh, you know, South Korea never, especially since they ruined my 2002 World Cup. No, the refs ruined it. It's not South Korea that ruined it. Uh, but it was one of those few scenes as you, you usually won. Uh, I always find myself often cheering for the whole Swiss. With South Korea's case, it never worked out because it was so blatant. However, um, my stance on South Korea changed pretty much around that World Cup because they actually played really, really well, had some interesting players. Uh, Lask also had, had in 2002, actually, if you, 2001, some South Korean players. So, you know, uh, getting there and at the moment with Son, uh, Son Hyung Min, uh, here, Son Min Hyung, Son Hyung Min, Son, <laughs> Son Hyung Min, uh, probably my, one of my favorite, if not the favorite player in the Premier League. So, you know, fine. Now I have, I got already this year, uh, the current South Korea away jersey, which is an absolute stunner. Totally love this one. Uh, it's an away jersey. And um, so I thought, yeah, South Korea will probably play a lot in red. So uh, it might be nice to have this backup. And this has tiger straps. This also has tiger straps. So this is fine. I also, I gotta say, Despite that being uh, the 1970s soccer ball on there, I really like the crest because the tiger looks quite nice on it. And then you have the tiger straps in here. Uh, also on the, on, the, on the back, it's really, really nice. It's of course uh, the Band 8 template from Nike. But um, I really gotta say, the more I look at it, this might be actually one of the better shirts from that World Cup. I never really considered it, but you know, you see the tiger the, the, the tie strap, it has actually a v-neck collar. Ah, uh, yeah, that Nike logo is coming off a little bit. It, it has been worn, definitely, but it's, it's a really nice shirt, so I'm quite happy to have it. So, yeah, now I have five Asian shirts. My Asian collection is growing. Good. We have an Asian Cup coming up next year, which I am intending to cover. Uh, that's going to be interesting how I'm going to manage with just five shirts. <laughs> well, let's see. In any case, please let me know what you think about this jersey. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more and I will talk to you soon. Bye! I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day.